everyone, it's Angela Irene with Aged Goodness. Thank you so much for joining us today. It is a special edition of Thrift Haul Monday. We ended up, uh, you know, having a great thrift haul, but I don't, I don't want to panic anybody. We have had this haul for weeks and weeks and weeks. I have just not had the time to film. So we're going to go ahead and show you what we picked up for the haul. And most of you know we drive over two hours to get to the Goodwill Outlet, aka The Bins. And these are the treasures that we found that day. So I want to tell you, uh, please, wherever you are today, I hope that you're home, you're being safe, and oh, just keep washing your hands. They keep telling us that, so I'm going to put that through, so please keep washing your hands. All right, here we go. Okay, the first thing that we found yarn how cool is this i used to do a lot of crocheting um i don't know how i ever had time to do that but i picked up five and a half skeins of this multi kind of color so this would be great for maybe you know start of a project or i have something in mind i want to do for next christmas so we'll see we'll see how that goes and then speaking of Christmas, we ended up with a few cute ornaments, like this one It is in the box. I'm not going to take it out. I had a hard time getting it back in. But it's a cute little snowman. And then the Miss picked this up, Petite Pie Mold. We had something really similar to this, and they make great little hors d'oeuvres. I mean, this thing is really cute, and it doesn't look like it's ever been used. And it's pink. Come on now. That's so up her alley. Uh, I thought this was going to be empty. It was an Avon box. It was kind of getting tossed around. And you open it up, and it is the Breast Cancer Awareness Ornament. So, uh, folks, if you are past due, please go in and get your mammogram done. Make sure you're, you're checking, self-checking every month. And if it's time to go see your doctor, if it's your regular appointment time, please, please go and keep that appointment. Um, you know, you all know why um, you know, somebody very special to us in our community ended up having breast cancer after getting checked um, for, she hadn't been checked for a while. So please, please, please go get checked. Okay, so that was great. And most of you know too that there is a gal um, and somebody always saves her jewelry. Uh, um, but look here. The Miss found this great little starfish glass pendant. How nice is that? And one of our favorites would be, you know, the beadwork. She found that. I mean, it wasn't a ton of stuff we found, but it's kind of like a win-win, yeah? And this would be one of the, you know, the little bracelets with the melted glass. Uh, this one happens to be little dolphins. And then I found this little charm. And it's kind of a less expensive, you know, kind of turquoise inlay looking piece, but it's still cute. It's an eagle. And then I found this little boot and it's some kind of like banded agate, something like that. But how cute is that? It's a single earring, but we can certainly take that off. And we have an unbranded little necklace, cute little baby roses. And this little hang tag is blank, so I'm not sure what's up with that, but mm. So we, we take that as a huge win. All right, the Miss found this bowl for her room. It's like a coconut with inlaid uh, shell. It's by Tozai, and they want $20 for this thing. Oh, yeah, not at the bins. We found this cute rubber, look at this. It looks unused, this rubber stamp set. With love, the flowers, cute little set. Um, again, Christmas, this cute little ornament tin. It's brand new, no one ever used it. And then, still finding Christmas stuff. So you can tell this, this haul was definitely over a month ago. These are cute little burlap bags. Uh, you know, you put the little string through and you make, you finish them up basically, this little kit. So I think we're going to utilize these next Christmas. Uh, one of my favorites. I love Tupperware. I am so sad that the whole set wasn't there. Uh, you know, we've got the cup, the three quarter cup, but that's okay. I mean, you can always use these and the colors are great. So that'll get put in there. 
And then the Miss Found These. Look at this one. Look at Santa. Santa's heavy. Uh, I mean, these are nice quality. And then we have the Snowman. I mean, come on now. Who doesn't love these, right? So, of course, they were coming home. Okay, this was one of our finds of the day. And this is Disney Teaspoon. And this one is from, like, Japan. And it's still on the card. And the comps for this particular spoon are, like, $70 and up. I don't, I don't know why. Maybe because it's, you know limited i don't know but look at that and why it was in the bins i have no idea speaking of not any clue how it ended up in the bins i'm waving around a knife mm, that's usually not a good thing it's not really a knife it's a letter opener and this is san francisco bay bridge cable wire and this was made out of the actual cable wire for this bridge and this was a souvenir you have to excuse us for letting dogs in and out uh, this was a souvenir that you could buy in San Francisco uh, and from what we can find this is also vintage and again I mean anywhere from 60 to like $180 oh, so how neat is that there we go and you don't know why any of this stuff ends up in the bins so I found this thing of patches and I'm like oh cool patches Except these are Star Wars Battlefront, and it says EA Dice Reveal 2015. And there is a whole set of these brand new patches. We've only been able to find one, one actual listing for this, and they were $8.95 each, and we have like 20 of them. So that was a nice find. All right. I love... I love aprons and found this cute little one look at this we've got the Christmas motif going on here really really cute I think this would look great on the mist and if we ever get our cooking channel going again when I wear my my fluffy gal one this would be great for her uh, this is a Valentino scarf and this is simply gorgeous. Look at this pattern. I mean, the quality. It's Valentino. Again, how did something so gorgeous end up at the bins? I have no idea. Then, you know, you there again, you don't know. This is Happy New Year, and this is a postcard from 1911. Uh, with the canceled stamp and this beautiful stylized woman. Oh, these things can be very pricey, but we only found the one. Then we found a few little things for sewing. And then the Miss found these two. Aren't these great? I mean, even though they could be salt and pepper shakers, but they do have the stoppers, they could also be ornaments which I thought was a great dual find so that was totally adorable okay and then we had and this has the <laughs> certificate of authenticity and this says Holland America line so this was from probably this cruise ship but to have this still with this was amazing and that kind of goes along with ta-da I'm sure these folks bought this cute little souvenir, you know, on the boat or at one of the stops in Holland. So that was a cute little duo to find. We also found some great um, scrapbooking stuff, quilting stuff. So we have this, you know, these little, you know, the little quarters. And then we have this little button cover, buttons. This is like, um, you know, you put it on the, you know, scrapbooking pages for, you know, flair. So some cute stuff there. Okay, this is almost like a coupon holder. But what I thought was cool about it was, look, it has a dollar in it. So this was, I mean, people say, oh my gosh, I found money at the bins. 
Well, we did. One dollar. It's still sitting in there. So this is a nice little, nice little thing. All right. I couldn't believe that this had gone through the main disaster of people, you know, rummaging through a bin. Look at this beautiful flag that somebody created. It is gorgeous. All of the work that somebody did. I mean, it's just gorgeous. And the sad thing is somebody, some, someone cut out the label before it got donated. I'm thinking that is just so sad. I would have loved to have known who created this gorgeous piece. So that'll be something that we wash and put up on the wall. I mean, it's beautiful. All right, next up, the miss wanted this for her room. So come on, it weighs next to nothing. We probably paid like 40 cents for the thing. And then we had some, come on, you knew we were gonna come home with some cute things, right? Look at this little change purse with the little cherries. I mean, the, adorable. This one um, could be a glass case with the adorable elephants. Mm, love that. Uh, this bill was Bill Blast. This tie is Bill Blast. Love the pattern. And this one was Stefano and Ricky. Love the colors in that one. And back in the day, Tech Deck was huge. Um, in fact, we had a ton of Tech Decks, including this pool. And we sold uh, the pool that we had for like 38 bucks. And this one is in amazing condition. And I mean, it costs like probably two bucks by the time we were out the door with it. So I think this one will go up for sale again. I mean, it's not as big as it was before. The skating community is going downhill again uh, in popularity. So I'm gonna say maybe 20, 25, but still a nice profit. Now, you know, we were gonna come home with some, you know, some nice finds. Okay, the first one is this one. This jacket is by Calvin Klein. It's a size 14. Look at, look at the amazing color, the style. I mean, that is a beautiful, beautiful style jacket. And it feels good too. And it's Calvin Klein. And then we end up with this little like evening purse. It has this great shimmer. Just a nice little basic, you know, beautiful little evening purse. This one is by Liz Claiborne. This change purse looks brand new. Doesn't look like anybody has ever done anything with it. Oh my, my word, it's adorable. Same thing with this one. This one's uh, Lauren, Ralph Lauren. Again, it's very stiff. It smells very new. I don't think anyone has ever used it yet. Totally adorable. And then last but not least would be this purse here. This color is amazing. Looks like a little saddle bag. And inside, it has the strap. Doesn't look like it's ever been used. I don't know if this was a kit or not, but look at this thing. It's amazing. And you know what? I think overall, we had a great day. Uh, the mister actually went with us this day, so it was a family affair, and I think we did pretty good. And it was fun to boot. All right, gang, thank you so much for watching our special edition of Thrift Hall Monday. Be safe out there. We're thinking about everybody. Thank you so much for liking, commenting, subscribing. Thank you so much for spending time with us. Until next time, take care. We'll see you soon.